Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, I have tips for you guys for earning extra income. Now I've been planning this video for a while, but I feel like every other week I was running across another idea. Now, several of these I do personally. Some of them I don't have time to do. I do have a full-time job during the week, but several of these I do during my downtime and they all pay out in cash. So we're talking a check sent to you in the mail, deposited into your bank account, PayPal, maybe even a Visa gift card, but not like an Amazon gift card, Starbucks gift card, whatnot. So these do pay out in cold hard cash. Now I do have some apps that I use where I earn points and those points add up and I can cash those out for Starbucks, Amazon, um, Michael Kors, Kate Spade, whatever, gift cards. Um, let me know in the comments below if you guys would want to see a video on that and be sure to subscribe so that you'll know when I post that video. Um, I have several of those that I do that I love, but like I said, these seven that I'm going to go over today actually pay out in cold hard cash, you guys. So let's go ahead and hop into it and see if we can help you guys make some extra money. All right, so the first one here is Lionbridge and they are basically like a staffing agency or vendor for contractors. So they have projects you can do, um, you come on board with them, you can do these projects basically from anywhere. So I'm like at home and I have a couple of hours, I can log in and see if there are projects and tasks to do. Now this is kind of difficult to do as your primary source of income in my opinion, just because there are times I log in and there are no tasks to do. So um, this is something that is definitely just a part-time thing for me. So if you need that additional income, I would definitely look into it and we're gonna dig into their site just a little bit here. All right, so here we're gonna take a look at the jobs that they currently have available in the United States. If you're located elsewhere, you can click there and see what they have as well. So you'll see here they have Raiders for Spanish language. Um, let's see, they have Ads Assessors, Ads Evaluator, Raider. So let's go ahead and click on Raider here and you'll see what the job description and job qualifications are if you're interested in that. So it looks like for this role, they want you to be pretty knowledgeable and involved in social media. You have to be pretty familiar with current and historical events, um, high school diploma, and it kind of gives you a brief description at the top so you would know if this is something you were interested in. Um, and it does tell you at the top there that this one is a part-time hourly position. I am going to link all of these sites down below so that you guys know where to go if you are interested in applying or getting involved with any of these companies or apps. Next up we have a pen. This company from what I can see is very similar to Lionbridge. They're a staffing agency slash vendor. Their projects seem to be kind of similar, the positions they offer. Now I am not technically employed by them as a contractor, but I do projects um, every now and then like they'll drop a survey and you'll get five bucks for doing the survey. And the survey um, or task may be something um, really simple usually takes no longer than a few minutes and they paypal you the five bucks within a few days so again this is not something that i guess unless you actually take a role with them i can't speak on that because i don't have a role with them but just on a project by project basis not something that i feel could be a um, sole source of income but again a nice option to have if you just need to bring a little extra money or a little extra income into your home and here's the form or application as to how you can get registered with them to even be involved on a project by project basis next up is a virtual assistant now I don't do this I've looked into it a little here and there. This is actually what I do in my full-time job. I'm an administrative assistant. So um, I imagine it would be pretty similar, but this one, you work from home, guys. I don't know anything about the pay. I don't know how consistent it is from a work perspective. I did look into them and they do ask that you're available basically Monday through Friday, eight to five. So I'm thinking it is a full-time uh, remote administrative assistant. So if you're looking for something to maybe be your sole source of income or you have a part-time job now and you need um, that is maybe just weekends and you need that Monday through Friday, eight to five, I would definitely look into this. Again, I'm gonna link the site down below, but there are plenty of jobs here, not just uh, virtual assistant jobs. Um, if you're in marketing 
or some other area of expertise, definitely check this site out. Also, a simple Google search will return so many options for these as well. So just poke around and see what you can find. You really never know what's out there in 2019. All right, guys, last but not least here is similar to Lionbridge and a pen in that it's a crowdsourcing marketplace. This is Amazon Mechanical Turk by that Amazon. Um, I haven't done any projects or tasks with them yet, but from what I gather is you log in, you can either, there are projects you can accept and work on right then, and then there are projects you have to qualify for. It'll tell you about how long it'll take to do those projects and how much you'll get paid to do those projects. Again, I haven't done any with them yet, so I don't know step by step, but if you're looking for an extra little bit of income, I imagine you can do pretty well here as long as you qualify for the project and you have the time to accept and work them. If you guys do Amazon Mechanical Turk, please let me know how it goes. I may be more motivated to get in there and do some of those if I know exactly what to expect. So please let me know in the comments down below if you do those or really any of these and what you think of them. Okay, next up, we're stepping outside of the box here with a research company. This popped up in my Facebook feed a couple of years ago. So I went on their site. Basically, you fill out information that pertains to you, your age, whether or not you have kids, you're married, you own a home, things like that, so that they know what surveys are best to drop to you. Um, also, anytime you can log into their site and see if there are any surveys that catch your eye. You'll fill out the survey and they'll contact you if you're qualified to actually fully participate. So this may require you going into their office and like um, meeting in a group setting or I've done it from home you can get paid in the form of Visa gift cards I think we've gotten cash before and I've also gotten a free product I will link that video down below you guys may have seen my cleaning video where I use a Hoover wet dry vacuum that I got this is I think almost a $300 product that I got for free I did a project with them for about six to eight weeks I think it was and I got to keep the product and then I also got paid in the form of a Visa gift card for like 150 bucks as well so you guys may have seen before there was a list of several major cities and I chose Charlotte since that's what I'm closest to and here I'm just showing you guys a list of the studies that are available in the Charlotte area again you'll complete the questionnaire and then they'll contact you if you fully qualify to proceed in the study with this one, like some of the others, definitely not a sole source of income here, but if you need some extra income, if these studies pertain to you, if you live in a city that's close, uh, you may need to block a couple of hours if you do get called in to go into their office. Um, we've done that and we've also done the one that I did from home, which was a few minutes a week for six to eight weeks to get that completed. As you guys know, a couple of years ago, my husband left his full-time job to start his own business and while he's been building that business i've been looking for any way to earn extra income and i ran across this app called inbox dollars you download it on your phone you can even do it on your desktop like i'm doing here like i'm showing you guys but basically you take surveys you watch tv clips you play games they've just introduced that you play a game directly there in the app you don't have to download anything extra on your phone you play the game right there and they give you cash for it they also have links to other sites for shopping and cash offers off of their site so say you they have a link from groupon you follow that link to groupon you purchase something from groupon you'll get credit with inbox dollars the one thing about inbox dollars you do have to have a minimum of 30 dollars to cash out so keep that in mind while you're building it like last night i went online i noticed i had like eight dollars and something you guys will see here i went on there watched a couple of TV clippings, played one little game, and I easily have probably over 10 bucks now. So it really is that easy. If you need to pass time, if you're in line at the grocery store or you're in line to get your kids from school, just download this and see what you can do. All right, y'all, this last option I'm gonna tell you guys about is an app. I heard so much about it before I finally downloaded it. I saw ads on YouTube. I saw ads pop up in my newsfeed on Facebook. I heard ads on my favorite radio morning show. It was everywhere, but I just thought it was too good to be true, so I didn't do it. And I'm so glad that I did. Basically, you download this app called GetUpside. 
When you need gas, you open the app, you find a gas station that's close to you, you hit claim. You have four hours to get there to get gas. Once you get gas, you have them print your receipt, you scan it and upload it into the app, and within a few minutes, your account is credited with cash. It will tell you in the app how many cents per gallon you're getting credited at each gas station. Some will offer 25 cents per gallon, some will offer 20. So just be aware of that. If you're just a couple of miles from the next gas station and you have gas, you may want to do that to get that perk. I've only gotten gas with it one time so far and I already have four bucks. Another great thing about this app is the referral bonus. So um, if I refer a friend and they use it, from the time they use it on out, I'll get one cent for every gallon of gas they buy. And then if they refer someone who purchases gas, I'll get half a cent for every gallon of gas bought by someone they refer. So it kind of is the gift that keeps on giving. Um, I know I heard some crazy story about a guy who made 900 bucks and was able to buy his kids Christmas off of cash he had earned back in this app. So crazy I know, don't know how true it is. I'm just throwing it out there. Um, that sounds pretty awesome to me. I wish I had had this when I installed my app. Maybe if I would have listened to all the ads, I would have, but I'm going to drop a link down below so you guys will get an extra 15 cents a gallon cash back on your first use. So be sure to click that down below. Something else I've heard that this app um, is trying to do, and maybe they've done it in other cities, just not mine, is um, for groceries and food as well at restaurants. So I guess they're trying to roll out something there where you, you go to that restaurant or go shop there and scan your receipt and you get cash back that way as well. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoy this and check it out. All right, guys, that is almost a wrap on this video. Just, I wanna recap for you guys so you know what I use, what I don't use, what can be done at home, what needs to be done on the go, and so on. So of the ones I mentioned, the ones that I use personally are Lion Bridge, A Pen, l &E Research, Inbox Dollars, and Get Upside. The ones I haven't actually done, but I'm signed up for is Amazon Mechanical Turk. And as I mentioned before, the virtual assistant I haven't done. That seems more of an actual full-time job from home. Um, of all of those, Lion Bridge, a pen, Amazon Mechanical Turk, um, inbox dollars, and the virtual assistant, you can all do strictly from home. Um, l &E research, depending on the study you get involved in, um, may require you to go to their office, or you can do it from home. And then with the um, get upside, obviously, you have to download it and go get gas. So. Um, like I mentioned before, I have some other apps that I use to earn points on to get gift cards. Let me know in the comments below if you'd like to see a video on that and be sure to subscribe. If you enjoyed this video, like it and share it with your friends and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!